Okay, y'all. So real quick, let me tell you guys about plasmoids because for some reason, I don't think we have ever heard about the topic. And excuse my man, he's out behind me sleeping and snoring, baby. This is something serious. Focus, focus on me. And before we go too far, go ahead and engage from top to bottom up. But yeah. Um, for those that didn't know, a plasmoid is basically a generalized source of plasma that gives off a magnetic energy. And it also is able to pull things to it and pull things away from it because of its magnetic energy. Now, there has been a couple of theories going on. We're going to review a couple of them, okay? So the first thing is first. Y'all been seeing these drawings? Apparently, these drones have been um, going after plasmoids, okay? And they've been in New Jersey. They've been in Virginia. They've been in other places, kind of in the northeast um, region. And, um, yeah, they are trying to get these plasmoids. Now, why would the U.S. government want the plasmoids? Well, guys, plasmoids are is basically plasma in its most organic form that has conjoined together kind of like the energy source of the sun if you want to break it down like you know elementary style the sun is a big form of a plasmoid it's full of plasma and it literally emits an energy that can create life and all sources of energy on earth so imagine these smaller variations of suns in a way some people have been calling them angels I don't know whether it is or it isn't. Some people have been talking about plasmoids um, being contained by um, the Ark of Covenant um, and talking about Moses and how Moses was told to basically get the source of energy and take it, uh, you know, away out of Egypt. And that's kind of how the sea parted because he had the plasmoids and because of the energy being so strong, it parted the sea because of this magnetic force who knows um so people were like i was saying talking about it could be variations of angels and that angels are coming down to basically protect us or give off a message or to um kind of uh what's the word alert us give us a heads up as to what's going on next i don't know what i do know is that the u.s government has been trying to collect them because they have been multiple 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 signs and multiple <laughs> multiple of them out there and so because of the surplus of plasmoids the u.s government has been trying to collect them because that would be one like a, a golden ticket as to the usage of this energy because you don't need fossil fuel for if you have a plasma you don't a plasmoid you don't need you know all these different kind of chemical based radiation based um you know energies if you have plasmoid but like you can use a plasmoid for all that and it's an organic energy which means that it will help preserve the earth because right now with all the fossil fuels and the biochemistry and the, all these other things we got going on our earth is dying like like this is a real thing y'all like this is a real thing. Y'all think they've been talking about going out of space or trying to find other ways for other planets for no reason? No, they're trying to do that because literally the way in which we live as a whole society, the it is killing Mother Earth slowly but surely because of everything that's going on. Now, there has been another theory that the sun may burst and then bye bye everybody, but who knows? You know, that, that's not me to say. Let's stay on topic. Y'all, collecting the plasmoids can help basically prevent and kind of contain the growth or the progression of you know our planet earth because now we can use the plasmoids as a form of energy however all the videos that i have seen of the drones that have been going over everywhere collecting or trying to collect the energy source or the power source it looks like because they it doesn't want to be collected it's pushing the drone away pushing it back pushing the drone away pushing it back because the drone is being pushed away and it's trying to get closer drone being pushed away and it's trying to get closer and as soon as the drone gets on top of it or near the plasma too close it basically gets float like you know basically it, it's dead they kill it it kill it, it gets it out of the sky you see you'll see like the colors of the the drones being like blue or green and then once it touches the plasmoids you'll see it um in red falling from the sky like every time so that means that 
you know the plasmoid is not, not allowing it to collect its, its energy and or because the plasmoid is so strong the drone can't contain with sand the energy and it you know basically the battery runs out or it just it dies you know it it's, it it breaks basically and you see it falling from the sky so this is the overview okay this is the overview of what a plasma is because i was very per previously i posted a video asking you guys what's been going on and what's been like why are we seeing all these drones and this is what's going on the government is trying to collect the plasmoid energy why are the plasmoids here where why are the plasmoids where did they come from somebody was like plasmoids have always been there but it's just now emitting the energy oh the whole thing about the angels so basically they're saying that plasmoids are also a form of consciousness and you know how we have our brain and how our brain can function our whole body but yet we are spiritual beings living a um, physical reality the spiritual being part is a variation of plasmoid the matter in which plasmoids um contain itself within like the plasma the matter of the plasma basically that it's containing itself within is basically seen as a consciousness energy which is why people were saying that they're angels in a way because when you think about an aura that's also an energy first of all every even me this phone my fingers my eyes all this is a bunch of atoms like we have to break this down to a science like when you're talking about these kinds of things it's kind of like the science science is just like the explanation of like the explanation of trying to science is just basically for me a way in which man tries to explain God's gifts you know like how and like break down how life is and why we do this and how the, the explanation the the human man version of why things are what they are and how they are and how they were made and how they were produced and how it was created and how it functions on the man terminology scientific versions you know that's what i think science is so when we're talking about people saying that plasmoids can be angels and we also could be a variation of what a plasmoid is as far as a consciousness basis i i'm not i'm not i'm not it doesn't sound too far-fetched for me i'm not saying that i think it's right wrong true or false i just don't think it's too far-fetched um because we are physical beings living a spiritual no we are spiritual beings living a physical reality so with that being said everybody talking about not everybody but a lot of people talks about you know our energy is sitting to heaven and our energy is sitting to nirvana or after we pass away if you're a christian or religious or spiritual that your energy will continue because energy does not stop it keeps going so this physical matter being may be gone but my energy is going to continue to another source whether that be heaven nirvana limbo as people call it um you know uh into another body because some people believe the reincarnation into an animal i don't fucking know the sea you know who knows for sure but i mean i believe in ascending i want to ascend maybe put me to the next variation of, of good energy like let me just be in a good okay but like you know but with that if you believe in christianity or religion or ascension all that kind of stuff that you have to believe that your soul is something so the explanation of what that soul is or that energy is is what people are talking about when they talk about plasmoids or a variation of plasmoids y'all this is just all theoretically proven or there are the theories that people are talking about but for sure this is not a theory the u.s government is trying to collect these plasmoids and that's why they have been putting these drones on people's house. If your area or where you are is emitting high energy of radiation, that's why it's over your home. Yeah, I should have said that first after all this whole video. But yeah, don't forget to engage top to bottom or bottom to top, whatever way. What are your opinions? Let me know down below. I'll see you in my next video.